I need to turn um, my PlayStation off. Give me a second. God damn it. Let's see. We, I think we got time for like one more. It's also <laughs> another Nintendo story. <laughs> um, maybe le- maybe less dumb moves. Whatever. We'll we'll see. Oh wait, my 3DS is done updating after like four oh, years. Oh. Uh, let's see. New story. Let me go ahead and mark this to what? What's the time code? One forty-one. Uh, Nintendo has announced that it currently has zero plans for a new Switch model beyond the recently showcased OLED variants. Uh, leading up to the announcement of the OLED Switch, uh, fans were fervent in discovering more details about a led about an alleged uh, Switch Pro that would yield 4K resolutions. With some still holding out. Uh, holding out hope that this uh, version is still around the corner, despite the OLED coming out, I believe, like, what, October? Um, Nintendo's rush to announce uh, such development of a new console is unusual for the company, which is more than I'm sorry, which was more than likely done to stifle the discussion as to ensure the sales of the OLED switch aren't impacted. Um, Industry analyst uh, Matt Piscatella has been on record as saying... Uh, Nintendo frequently does uh, refreshes a model. I'm sorry, they do uh, model refreshes of, of uh, current hardware just to keep a steady line in profit. So there's no real uh, dips or anything like that. They're like this is definitely par for the course for Nintendo. It's not some weird thing. Um, and additionally, Nintendo has outright denied a, an earlier Bloom, Bloomberg report asserting that the upgraded OLED model would yield higher profit margins. Uh, saying that it's incorrect. So even though it's three hundred fifty dollars com- as uh, compared to the regular three hundred for the regular Switch and then two hundred for the Switch Lite, um, apparently whatever they they're putting in there, I guess it's just the OLED screen. Uh, they're not necessarily seeing a higher profit margin. Um, yeah, I I mean the Switch not Switch Pro, <laughs> the uh, <laughs> the the Steam Deck is a real thing. So if people want like more powerful hardware says so not 4k but that option's out there now um i'm i'm kind of fine with with my current switch just the regular launch one uh, i didn't get red and blue i wish i did i got stuck with the regular black ones are you lucky um yeah i don't know i'm fine with current nintendo hardware i i don't really crave a switch pro I mean, yeah, I I'm I'm good. I don't, like I never buy a Nintendo system for the stellar uh updated uh you know cutting edge technology because Nintendo never does that. Yeah. So yeah. you go in knowing what you're going to get. Yeah, yeah. Like my my Switch is my portable indie machine and occasionally Skyward Sword or Ace Attorney, you know, like mm-hmm. maybe Monster Hunter every now and then. Like, I, I, I know what I got my Switch for, and I use it for that. And I don't need a Pro. I don't even need an OLED. You know, like, I'm, I'm good. I, I was even thinking to myself the other day because you know, I think I'm getting to the point of my, uh, to my life. Even though I'm eternally 19, and no factual birth certificate or anything can deny that. Um, <laughs> Or, you know, I'm, I'm starting to kind of want to, like, maybe save money up for a house or whatever. You know, it's the Bay Area, so fucking fat chance of that happening. Probably going to have to move out <laughs> of uh, the Bay Area for that to happen. Or even yeah. just California in general. Um, Go start just, like, a commune in Wyoming. Oh, hells yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, yeah, I'm just like, man, do I really need a freaking... Um, I almost said Switch Deck. A Steam Deck. <laughs> do I really need a Steam Deck? I'm just like, you know what? If I'm playing handheld, I'm probably I'm not going to be like, even if I get the Steam Deck, like I already have a monster PC, like anything lesser than that is already going to be a downgrade. So I'm just like, I don't know. I'm fine. Do I need to spend six hundred dollars on a on a Steam Deck? I don't know. I'm, I'm I'll probably wind up canceling it. Um, Yeah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> what about you, Sarah? So I got the OLED switch. Uh, cause I'm a creature of chaos and I was like, sure, why not? Couldn't get the white one though. It's really kind of ticked me off, but, uh, yeah, I strictly got it cause I use my switch for traveling. I'm one of those people. I rarely touch my switch unless I'm traveling. Uh, and I travel a lot, you know, I traveled a lot pre pre COVID I'm traveling during COVID I'm being safe, all that stuff. But like, 
I have anxiety being on planes, so being on my Switch for hours kind of helps. And, like, I also got the OLED because for, like, my vision's terrible. Half of the games I play on Switch, I need to play, like, this close to my face because I can't see shit. And since the OLED's all about making things brighter and making the screen bigger, I partially only got it for that to, like, help myself, like, I don't know, play games better on the go because that's always cool. And also I need to see my wonderful Atome dating sim C CGs in the best light possible because my Switch is my Atome machine. Which was my joke about the Steam Steam thing, by the way. I said I would have just bought, bought it to play, date, to, to play dating sims on it. Because, of course, I would. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I got the OLED. I'm actually kind of excited because Walmart keeps lowering the price, baby. It's now below $300. Because of Walmart's crazy price matching feature, uh, it's gone down like 60-something dollars. <laughs> because people on the internet keep finding it cheaper, so Walmart keeps lowering the price on it. Nice. Oh, I totally so, forgot. They did a uh, fucking... I don't know if you want to consider a remaster. <laughs> they, put, they put Luigi's Mansion 1 on the 3DS. So, to go back to an earlier story, if they're going to take away the eShop, say goodbye to Luigi's Mansion 1. I guess and 2 also, but... Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I Sorry for interrupt. No, I just... Yeah, I, yeah, I got the OLED, because I'm a creature of chaos. And I fought those crowds. I probably punched someone over the internet for it. <laughs> I was probably just like, give me that damn OLED so I can play pub, pub encounters on a bigger screen! As I like beat somebody over the head with my two switches. Yes, I have two switches. No one will buy. Oh that damn! You know what? <laughs> I never played a Link Between Worlds, and it's twenty bucks. Same with Majora's Mask. <laughs> Are you just like going through the three DS and eShop now? Like, sir, charge you more. <laughs> Wait, Actually, that means I, he's 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 busy. I can discuss oh. pub, pub encounters. <laughs> yeah, they're sneak it in. They're, they're twenty bucks right now. I mean, keep, shit, keep might as well going. grab it. Keep, keep going. I can see all those sexy C CGs in the brightest screen Wait, possible. It's gonna be how, great. How do you see all your old purchases and stuff? See now, keep I talking got... to Abba, hurry, go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now now you've got me look, wanting to look at. No, I I'm not gonna open my 3ds and look at the eShop. I don't need to buy more <laughs> games that I'm never going to play. Especially since I started playing Final Fantasy XIV, and now I don't play anything else. I mean, I can't say anything. I still play WoW every damn day of the week. <laughs> anyway, shit, where was and, I? And Rainbow Six Siege every night, so... <laughs> um, Something <laughs> about Nintendo and their... Uh, yeah, Nintendo's a weird company. You know, at least, at least Nintendo allowed dating sims. And I, then I am in a very happy place. Hey, if, if Nintendo's down for uh, incest and Fire Emblem, they're down for dating sims. That that's that's far less risky for them. Uh, you do know that Pub Encounters was on the front page of the Nintendo eShop, and the first image that they showed was the old man love interest licking your leg. Correct. I am not depraved, so no, I did not know that. Go Nintendo! Go! <laughs> you allow anything you want. Oh, Nintendo, more like Sintendo. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> For the record, I did not romance the old man that, that licks your leg, because that shit's weird. I at least have my standards. Jesus it doesn't involve old men licking this my leg. This podcast has standards. Of some variety. My own yeah. personal standards. <laughs> so I feel like all my standards went out the window when, you know, I became I became an Adler simp. I believe all my standards were, went out the window. That implies you ever had any. Anymore. I did! I just lost them for a minute there, but it's okay. They're back. Oh, shit. Um, you know, I think we actually have time for one more that we can that we can try to squeeze on in. Uh, let's see what's this time go. That is 150. 